Hi guys, as you can see, uh, I'm tired. Um, work today was actually not my normal work day. Um, someone was sick at work and I had to go in. And this is how my day started. This morning I woke up and I was like, listening, go, is that rain? It was freaking rain. So I walked outside and like, it was pissing down. And I'm like, I chucked my umbrella out ages ago because I broke it. And all I had was giant wheelie bin garbage bags. So I cut one up and put it on as a poncho. Walked up. As I got up, it stopped raining. Oh. So that was the first thing. Now the second thing this morning was... Um, okay, got to work and there was a ton of work. Now, one of the jobs I was doing, um, what was a part of Chrysler, Dodge, and Jeep balloons, um, with the Chrysler balloons. And for some reason, the print wasn't printing right. And it was stuffing up the prints every time. It got to the point um, we ended up having to put on every second um, spot on the balloon, uh, on the machine. And... Um, I got to the point I was accidentally putting on the wrong slot, so I ended up going around pulling all the second slots out, um, the air release, because there's like a little air release that pops the balloons off the machine. I stopped that from coming out so I didn't accidentally load it up with a new balloon. And that took me, um, what was it, Half an hour before lunch and half an hour after lunch to get it done. So about an hour. And that was ridiculously long. And I was glad to get that over. And then we started another job. What we had to get done before I went home. And, like, it was 2,000 balloons. It printed well. Got down to the last hour. I'm going, am I going to get this done? Am I going to get this done? So I don't like leaving without um, a job completely done. But I like finishing 10 minutes to 15 minutes before it's time to go home so I have time to take myself and do everything I have to do before I go out and walk up to the bus stop so got it all done happy 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 happy, happy. got back to Russell Island started walking up the road after I had stopped the IGA to grab something and it pissed down but luckily someone picked me up and I didn't have to walk all the way home so, that that was basically my day in a nutshell, and I I'm glad, glad I I I wasn't um, that much for pain in the day. So, <sighs> trying to think of what else I'm going to talk about. There's something I talked about before. Um, what made my last film. Thing, 16 minutes and went, nah, too long. Too long, guys. I went to film today because of the rain and being busy at work. Um, look at my nail. Oh, let me, let me check it. Look at my nail. Look at all the ink over my nail. That'll be like that for another two weeks. Uh, like all the way through my nails. I've got ink everywhere. Uh, latex ink stains and it stains for a while because it gets into your pores and like it's a pain in the ass you can see you got a little bit of white ink and that's the other thing with it if you don't look when you're washing yourself you find all these marks over your days down the track you go, I didn't know that I didn't know that was there so it looks like not too badly inked up today. So, well, I'll call that quits for today. As you can hear, I'm losing my voice because of the dry. <clears throat> how the compressor dries up the air. So, I'll let you go, you guys. Go. You have a great night. <clears throat> and I'll try and drink some orange juice to get my voice back. Until tomorrow, guys, you stay safe, and I'll see you around, guys. Bye.